This is breaking news. King Charles and Kate Middleton feel less alone while battling cancer together. King Charles and Princess Kate Middleton both revealed they were battling cancer earlier this year, and a source exclusively tells Closer that the diagnosis makes them feel less alone. Kate would have been there for Charles no matter what, of course, but now when she finds something that gives her comfort, like a new hand cream or comfy bathrobe or a new TV show that she thinks is hysterical and takes her mind off of everything, she makes sure to share it with Charles, reveals the insider. Previously, on Wednesday, April 17, a separate source told Closer that their separate health struggles had brought Kate, 42, and Charles, 75, together. Kate is the daughter that Charles never had and they have never been closer than they are right now, the source said. Going through this cancer journey together has brought them together in a way that they never expected, but is much appreciated by both of them. On January 17, Hellas officials announced that Kate had undergone a planned abdominal surgery one day prior. A few weeks later, on February 5, Buckingham Palace announced that Charles, 75, had been diagnosed with cancer after it was detected on a scan following a benign prostate issue in January. During the King's recent hospital procedure for benign prostate enlargement, a separate issue of concern was noted. Subsequent diagnostic tests have identified a form of cancer, the statement read. His Majesty has today commenced a schedule of regular treatments, during which time he has been advised by doctors to postpone public-facing duties. Throughout this period, His Majesty will continue to undertake state business and official paperwork as usual. While royal representatives didn't specify what type of cancer the king had, In Touch reported on March 22 that Charles was battling pancreatic cancer and was only expected to live two more years. The same day the outlet reported the news regarding Charles, Kate revealed that she too had received her own cancer diagnosis. Tests after the operation found cancer had been present. My medical team therefore advised that I should undergo a course of preventative chemotherapy, and I am now in the early stages of that treatment, she said in a video via X. This of course came as a huge shock, and William and I have been doing everything we can to process and manage this privately for the sake of our young family. As you can imagine, this has taken time.